you satisfied with the road point? Yeah, we'll take the point, but you know when uh, we get the second goal early in the second half, I'd I'd like to see us try to close the game out. And obviously, there was a lot of time left, and we didn't do a good job with that. And probably could have done a better job on their second goal. But I thought Philadelphia played well. You could see they were a little bit more rested than, than us, and that makes a difference. You know, we we changed six players from our game Sunday, so uh, I give all guys credit dealing with. Uh, you know, the travel and, and getting the point and playing against a rested team. Uh, so, overall, I think we have to be pleased to leave with a point. Hi, this, uh, Bruce, I think coming in, you talked about this Philly team being a better team maybe than it's been in the past. Now that you played them. Well, you know, you I'll be honest with you, I haven't spent any time evaluating the Philly team, so I can't give you a, uh, an assessment of them. I'll let their coach do that. Well, no, they're good. Yeah, they're a good team. I, you know, I'm not spending a whole lot of time analyzing their team. I'm a little bit more concerned with ours. Go ahead. Both goals coming from areas outside the fullbacks. Is that something you were trying to? Uh, so about our goals? Yeah. Goals coming from outside. Um, I'm trying to think. I'm not sure what you're saying. Uh, Is that like an area we're trying to explore? Uh, no. Just playing soccer, you know. Obviously, they do a good job pulling their team in. I, I think their back line pushes in, so there's a little bit of space out in the flanks in the last third of the field. But, you know, just um, you, you take what they give you. And, and obviously, uh, both teams, you could see uh, Philadelphia in the second half, I think they utilize the flanks quite well uh, also. But, you know, nothing really by design, but, uh, you know, two, go two good goals by our team tonight. What was going on in the situation where Gio had to come off the field and they were looking at his He shoes? was, the fender cleated him and went through his cleat and uh, he, he was bleeding. So there was blood on his shoe. You know, all these important things, you know, we're worried about, uh, you know, spreading diseases, I guess, during the game. There was a little blood on his shoe, so he had to come off. Just, he seems like over the last... I don't know, maybe a month or more. It seems like he's been improving his passing. Do you see that? Do you see him? The Jossie's playing well. Uh, uh, I, I wish we could have kept him up top uh, more in the second half. Obviously, we, we made a change at halftime. And uh, I thought he, he played very well. Jossie's a, a, a team player. He goes wherever he's needed with our team, and he's just uh, getting better and better uh, every game. So uh, I'm real pleased uh, with his performance this year. Last question. Just, just going back to the goals, uh, the first one was very well-worked team sequence. What would you think of that play, just being able to, to have such a, a good build up and then capitalize it with a nice goal? It was a real good goal and a great finish by Robbie. And I thought uh, McGee's goal was a good one. With uh, I think there was some com combination play with uh, Dos Santos and Gerard, and uh, Mike did well to finish. So we we scored two pretty good goals. Thanks, guys. Thank you. Thank